Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Every Day. Today we're gonna to show you how to record from your webcam in Windows 11. It's really quite simple to do and it's free with the Windows camera app that's included with Windows 11. It allows you to take photos and do videos right there in Windows 11. So let's go ahead and dive right over to my Windows 11 desktop, get right into recording with our webcam. All right, so here we are on my Windows 11 desktop. And the first thing I wanna do before we open up the camera app is just make sure my webcam is working. So we're gonna head on down to the start menu here at the bottom and we're gonna right click on it, not left click, but right click. And a little menu should come up here. And we're looking for the option here that says settings. You can go ahead and left click on settings. That's gonna take you right into the system settings here in Windows 11. Over on the left hand side, you'll see a whole bunch of different options. We're looking for the second one down here that says Bluetooth and devices. Go ahead and left click on that. And we're gonna look for the one that says cameras. It's right here in the middle. Go ahead and left click on that. And in here, you're gonna see all of your webcams or cameras that are connected to your computer. Now, I happen to have a few of them. I have my CamLink 4K, which is what's showing the little video there in the corner that you're seeing. But I've also got my webcam here, a Logitech C920 webcam. That's what I wanna show you through the cameras app today. So we're gonna go ahead and left click on that. And we just wanna make sure that our camera is functioning properly. You'll see it here that you can see a preview image of it. You can actually adjust the brightness here as well as the contrast in here as well. So we do wanna make sure that our webcam is functioning properly. So do that first, and then we're gonna go ahead and close this out. And then we're gonna go and find the camera app. So to find the camera app, we're gonna just go to the start menu here and left click on it. We're gonna head up to all apps right here. And we're gonna go down to the letter C and you should see the camera app right here. Now, if you don't see that, you might need to go to the Microsoft Store to download it for free, but it should be included with Windows 11 and even Windows 10 as well. So let's go ahead and open up the camera app. All right, so it popped up that my Logitech C920 is connected. I can see myself there. Now, if you're not seeing yourself in the top right hand corner here, you should see a little camera. It says change camera. You may need to push on that and it'll adjust if you have multiple cameras, which one it is showing. Now there's several different options here. So on the right hand side, you'll see there's a um, video button as well as a camera button. There's a few other options there as well. We're not gonna go through those today, but you can take pictures or do video in here. So if I wanna take a picture, I just select the photo button here. I can smile and take a photo of myself. You can also set timers. So if I'd like to have a two second delay or a five second delay over here on the left hand side, I can just click through those. There's also a 10 second. So if I do the two second, just push the photo button there, you'll see a timer go down and it'll take a photo of me. And we'll show you where to find these photos a little bit later in this video. So that would be the photos app. Now, if we go up here in the top left hand corner, you'll see a little gear or a sprocket. And when you hover over that, it says settings. So we're gonna go ahead and left click on that. And in here, you're gonna see all sorts of settings that you can change. Now, the settings that you'll see in this program will depend on the camera you're using. So for camera settings here, I can turn on the pro mode if I like, which might give me a few other options. I can change the framing grid. So right now I've got the rule of thirds on. I can do the golden ratio. So if you want to um, have the grid on, you can easily do that. There's also crosshairs, different things in there. I like to use the rule of thirds. You can adjust the photo quality here. So on my webcam, I can go all the way up to 2.1 megapixels or 1920 by 1080. Each camera is gonna be different depending on the quality of your camera. When we go down to video here, we can also adjust the video quality. So if I click on video quality here, I can go from 1080p with my camera all the way down to 240p. I'm gonna leave mine on 1080p. And again, if you have a higher quality camera, um, you'll see different options here as well. You can also adjust the flicker reduction right here as well. So let's head on back out here. And on the right hand side, we're gonna go ahead and click on our video button. So this will allow us to take video. The other one was the camera mode, of course. And in here, we can make a few adjustments. So on the left hand side, you can do auto focus or manual focus. So if I click on this, right now it's on auto here at the bottom. I can adjust it manually if I like, all the way to blurry. I'm gonna leave that on auto. I can also adjust the brightness here. So if I wanna make it really bright or darken it down, I can easily do that right there. So once you're all set and you're ready to record, what we would just do is left click on the take video button here on the right hand side and it should start recording. So let's do that. Three, two, one. 
I'm recording. Hey everyone, it is Ken here from Northern Viking Every Day. Thank you so much for watching today. When you are done, just go ahead and hit the stop button. There is also a pause button here if you'd like to pause recording and then start again. So we're gonna hit stop there. It's gonna stop recording and I'll show you where you can find your photos and videos right now. So to find our photos and videos that we just recorded, we can go to our file explorer. I happen to have a shortcut here. If you don't have a shortcut, go to your start menu and you can right click on it, not left click, but right click. And in the menu that pops up, you should see File Explorer right here. Go ahead and left click on that. That's gonna load up your File Explorer. What we're looking for over on the left hand side is the Pictures folder. Go ahead and left click on Pictures. And you should see the camera roll right here. This is where all of your photos and videos will go from the camera app. So we're gonna go ahead and double left click on that and you can see the photos we just took right in here. So let's open up a photo here. There's the first photo I took. Oh, and maybe there's another one. Oh, wow. All right, and for the video, let me go ahead and play that for you and show that it works. I'm recording. Hey everyone, it is Ken here from Northern Viking Every Day. Thank you so much for watching today. When you are done, just... There we go, and it's really that simple to record from your webcam here in Windows 11. So hope this tutorial was able to help you record from your webcam in Windows 11. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you're interested in learning how to edit the video you just took with your webcam, I will have a video up here in the corner, as well as in the description of how to edit with the Windows Video Editor. Make sure to check that out. Thank you so much for watching today. Remember to like and subscribe. And until next time, take care.